Hello everyone, Kanasa here. In this short, I'll be doing just a normal Saturn V launch. However, due to budget cuts, the Saturn launch tower elevator is out of commission. Not to worry though, we can get the crew on board so long as we build the rocket upside down. I mean, in the last show I did like this, I launched an upside down shuttle. It only seemed right to continue the trend. The parts used for the Saturn V are from Kanasa's parts pack. Definitely the best Saturn V parts about. I'd highly recommend checking it out. To build this, I built a normal Saturn V rocket. But being upside down, the rocket engines were in completely the wrong place. To get around this, I moved them onto the side of the rocket and slightly angled them out and added an extra F1 and J2 on the S1 and S2 stages. Being angled meant they weren't going to be providing as much thrust upwards, so I needed the extra engines. When staging, I decided to stage a second before the previous stage ran out of fuel. That way, the spent stage would fly off uncontrollably and prevent any unwanted collisions. This is all being done in a realism overhaul install with Principia, so about as realistic as Kerbal Space Program can get. And yet somehow, the upside down Saturn V is still a complete success, and manages to get to orbit with 4000 meters per second left in the S4B stage, plenty enough to get to the moon and attempt a landing. Don't forget to like and subscribe.